Welcome back to the FanDuel Hurry Up. You're with Justin Henry here. Today I'll be discussing three wide receiver prospects that I love heading into the NFL draft this week. There's no clear cut, just wide receiver one like there was last year with Jamar Chase. And so I've identified three that I like and I think can help franchises. There was a ton of moves made this offseason. Some big names were moved and there's a need at the wide receiver position for a lot of teams. So I'll dive into the prospects, what I like about them, what I'm concerned about and how they can help teams moving forward. The first receiver I want to talk about is Jamison Williams out of Alabama coming in at six foot two, 180 pounds. He's a little thinner on the wide receiver frame than you'd like to see. So it, helps, it hurts him a little bit when it comes to blocking. But man, does he have some speed. Uh, his, this guy can take the top off of defenses and will help a franchise out, especially one that's looking for a deep threat. He is coming off a torn ACL, unfortunately, and so there will be some recovery time there. But look for him to make an impact whatever team he's drafted on, especially if there's a team with a big arm quarterback that could use him. Some teams that come to mind, Green Bay Packers, Kansas City Chiefs, there was a lot of moves made this offseason, and, and Jamison Williams can help a team that needs a deep threat. So pairing him up with the big arm quarterback is probably the way to go. I expect him to be off the board in the first round. The next receiver I want to talk about is Drake London. Coming out of USC, 6'4", 220 pounds, has that big body, that big frame that you want to see out of the wide receiver position. Go up and get the ball catch contested balls as well. And so when it comes to Drake London, uh, the one thing that he does lack is the speed that you want to see at the wide receiver position, but he's able to make up for it with his frame. And so a team that could use a big body receiver would love to have Drake London, especially some of those teams that are young and developing and can use a nice safety valve for their young quarterbacks. When I look at potential fits for Drake London, I look at those teams in the middle of the first round that can use a safety valve, and I'm looking at the Washington Commanders and the Houston Texans there in the middle of the first as potential options for Drake London. The Commanders could use some help on the outside, obviously Terry McLaurin there, but could use another big body. And then as well as the Houston Texans who could use a franchise wide receiver to build upon. So Drake London in the middle of the first seems to be a lock. And I can see him being a really good fit with some of those teams there. And the last receiver I want to talk about is Garrett Wilson out of Ohio State. Coming in at six foot, 185 pounds. He's a little smaller than you want to see at the wide receiver position, but man, the dude can ball. And so he's, his ability to get separation, make contested catches, is what makes him a dynamic prospect that's probably going to go at the top of the first round somewhere. Uh, you love his ability to be able to make plays when needed and also make those tough 50-50 catches that a lot of receivers struggle to make. And so coming in, he's a little unpolished when it comes to route running, but I expect him to definitely enhance that skill and be a playmaker for a team long term. And when I'm looking at uh, Garrett Wilson, I'm looking at him in the, the back end of that top 10, those teams like the Atlanta Falcons, the New York Jets, that need somebody to come in and just be an overall dynamic playmaker. So I think he'll be a very good fit for a team, especially with a young and developing team that has the chance to work with them. So those are three prospects that I really like heading into the NFL draft this week. All three wide receivers have the ability to help out a franchise and are expected to go in the first round. What wide receiver prospects are you looking at to help your team? Make sure you follow FanDuel for more and catch you on the next hurry up.